Hi all, in this video I am going to show you guys a DaVinci Resolve Fusion tutorial while using ASUS color space. So the issue is that on DaVinci Fusion if you create anything, test, background, paint or any 3D object, anything, the color you see on the Fusion is not going to be the same on edit page or the color you choose on the color section of that particular node will not be shown same in the edit page i will show you that in my fusion i choose the white color and if i skip to the edit page you can see that there is a small difference in the white it is not the exact white i will show you the exact white on the edit page this is the exact white and this is the white we created on the fusion page so you can see the difference and in this video i'm going to show you guys the solution for this issue uh, first of all on davinci fusion you need to disable the display led by clicking the display led icon at the top of the viewer after that on the test node or the node that you got the thing you created just click the node and add a new tool called ss transform after that on ss transform on the input transform change that to srgb and the output transform to sscg then that's it then after that if you check on the edit page you can see the color on both is same so that's how you fix this issue and if you got multiple things that you created you can just simply copy and paste this node or otherwise you can add this node before adding the media out node but the problem with that is that sometimes it won't work on all the other node that you created personally i prefer you guys to add this ss transform node at the end of the node you created in that is like the one i showed that is test node ss transform node then all other node like that you create the node structure so you will not face any issue on your workflow so that's it that's all about this simple issue guys and the solution for this issue i hope you guys find this video useful if you do so hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe